Hello angels, my name is Ebony and in this video we're going to go over angel number 444. So if you are still seeing this number everywhere you go, all day, every day, go no further. I'm going to give you some new energy, some updated energy and information about this beautiful angel number. I've been trying to record this video like for the past two weeks and it just never felt right like i just i don't know it just never felt right because i wanted this video to be so special because i'm a life path four so i vibrate very heavy with four energy like my childhood home that i grew up in my neighbor's address has 444 in it i looked at it every day i had no clue I'm a life path for. I know I tell y'all that in like every video, but I can't help it. And in my 444 video that I recorded like five years ago, my backdrop fell. And I was like, <laughs> clearly I'm supposed to show my polish because I got my Minx Diva shirt on. And now I'm sitting with my name in lights. So I most definitely wanted to make sure I recorded this video in my new storefront, which is downtown on Hay Street in Fayetteville, North Carolina, because like it just always works out and it's just a beautiful and positive manifestation for me. And when I recorded my video five years ago, I was reading my sample I was reading my sample copy of my book, Angels Everywhere. Now I have them available for you to purchase. Like it's just, it's just so much good energy with this number for me. So I wanted to make sure I was in a, a nice, calm, pleasant state and energy. I wanted to make sure I looked good. My skin was popping. You feel me? I want to make sure I felt good before I recorded this video. And I just wanted to make sure that I was in like a, a loving space to um, give you some good and positive energy about this number. So one of the first messages um, when you see this angel number or like one of the main vibes of this number is like your connection to the spiritual, your connection to your angels and divine guidance and the universe and your intuition, your higher self. Like you have a strong connection to your angels. That's like the thing that just really always resonates with me with fours, like angelic guidance and protection. You're an angel, you're a chosen one. Many are called, but few are chosen. It ain't many of us. You feel me? So that's like a really good vibration and a good energy to like really tune into when you see this number. It's all about the angels. And I have been like tapping into my 444 playlist and like listening to the 444 album, trying to tap into like where I was, you know, five years ago and where I am today. Like I just wanted to kind of like get back into that space. So it really made me feel safe and protected and seen, made me feel seen and loved when I see this number, like, damn, I know you with me. That's one of the main vibes of this number. Like you got a close connection with your angels. They all over you. They all over you. It's like you have a hedge of protection, angelic guidance. Like you have myriads upon myriads of angels around you just waiting to help you waiting to protect you, waiting to give you love and usher in blessings for you in real life. So one of the ways you can really tap into this energy is by creating a sacred space in your home, wherever you spend the most time at, like just creating a space to where you can connect, like you can hear the voice, you can meditate, you can journal, you can pray, you can listen to your devotionals, you can read, whatever it is you got to do so that you can like tap in, create that space. Your angels want you to develop a routine to where you can start to make your dreams a reality. Like they hear your prayers, they all over you, they know what you want, they know what you need. They know what you're asking for. They know what you're lacking. They know your strengths. They know your weaknesses. They know everything about you. Like you can't hide from yourself. 
You can hide from everybody else. You can show the perfect version of you online. You can say the right words to the people that you're around. Like you could just paint this picture perfect image, but you can't hide from yourself. You can't, okay? So your angels want you to develop a routine so that you can start to make your dreams a reality because they know what you need, just like you know, but they know everything. Like you cannot hide from yourself. So when you see angel number 444, your angels want you to pay attention to your intuition. Those are messages from the spiritual. They're delivering you messages that only you can understand. You can decipher, you can decode. Okay, so pay attention to your intuition because there are spiritual signs all around you. Like 444, that's the spiritual sign. It's up to you to take heed to what the messages are. Your angels want you to, to embrace everything that happens to you. That resonated with me on so many levels because I don't know what life trying to teach me right now, but um, it's teaching. <laughs> it's most definitely teaching. So... Um, I'm really trying to like tap into like what the lesson is, like what's going on. All right. So don't spend a lot of time like trying to figure out what's going wrong. Just figure out like what lesson you're supposed to learn and take heed to that. Because once you wake up, you can't go back to sleep. Like you cannot keep making rookie mistakes. Okay, at this big age that we're at right now, we got to make better decisions. And I'm saying we, it's inclusive with me. Okay, so embrace the things that are happening around you and like really try to figure out like what role you play in it. Okay, sometimes it ain't other people, sometimes it's you. So pay attention to what's going on around you. And no matter what happens, your angels want you to remain peaceful. They want you to remain calm. Calm is a superpower. Don't let nobody get you out of your character. Okay? Don't let nobody get you out of your character. Like, stay zen, stay calm, stay peaceful, stay loving, but don't let nobody play with you. Okay? Like, so maybe you need to, like, establish some boundaries, but focus on staying calm. Calm is a superpower. This is so important because you have to have that aura of like protection because this number is like synonymous with spiritual protection. So you can't be knowing that you're protected and then anxious and scared and worried. Like those are two different ends of the stick. So your angels want you to just stay calm, know you're protected and um, move forward fearlessly. Like you're good, you're okay, okay, you're protected. You got a whole team of angels looking out for you. Like that spiritual protection is, it ain't no joke. Like it ain't no joke, it's real, okay? So don't try to like fight fire with fire. Focus on winning without fighting. Like I know I'm protected, so I'm chilling. I'm going to let you do whatever you're doing and I'm going to chill and I'm going to fall back and I'm going to let you get your karma, okay? When you see this number, all is well, you're in a safe space. All is well. I love that. I still love that. I loved it five years ago. It just made my heart melt. It's powerful and it's brief, but it is so um, important for me. All is well. Everything is going the way it's supposed to go. Everything is happening the way it's supposed to happen. So all is well. All is well. All is well. Write that in the comments. All is well. I love that. You're safe. You're protected. But picking it back on the boundaries, your angels want you to stay far away from weird energy. Stay far away from weird energy. Weird vibes, negative energy, um, people joking, playing with you too much, people talking about you, people like treating you like chopped liver. Anybody treating you like chopped liver got to go. You have to stay far away from weird ass energy right now. Like, no, you got to protect your aura, your space, your belongings. You got to protect your ideas. Like, you got to protect everything about you right now. Okay? So, if you know it's not a match, move on. If you know they really don't fool with you, leave them alone. Leave them be. I'm talking to myself. I'm talking to myself. <laughs> leave them alone. Leave them be. Stay far away from weird energy, man. Don't, it ain't that serious. 
it's gonna it's gonna be more detrimental in the end than it's worth okay and then your angels got to spend so much time and energy protecting you when they really could be sending blessings to you but because you want to stay stuck to some energy that ain't for you and ain't meant for you now you blocking your blessings so now they got to untangle all this mess that you don't put yourself in in order to create a space when really if you create the boundaries you good and they can just focus the energy on sending you blessings as opposed to getting you out of mess that you don't got yourself into preach ebony <laughs> okay so keep that in mind when you see angel number 444 like stay away from weird energy like just protect your space so that you are creating a space for the blessings to come don't dig yourself deeper in the hole by being around the wrong energy like when people show you who they are, believe them. If they say they don't want you, they don't want you. If they act like they don't fool with you, they don't fool with you. Like pay attention to the way people treat you. And if it's some weird energy, some weird vibes, they gotta go. Simple as that. You know what you need to do to protect. You may need to smudge. You may need to get some oils. You may need to anoint your space, your body. You may need to pray over it. Like, focus on protecting your space, your ideas, your mind, your mental, your emotions, your body, your skin, your health, your well-being, your house, your car. When you see angel number 444, the money coming, it's going to come. Like, you are stressing over some stuff that can happen in an instant, okay? The money is coming. Just go ahead and prepare. Like, get ready for it. Like, what do you want? What do you, what do you need it for? Who are you going to help? Who are you going to bless? What are you going to create? What are you going to build? Like, focus on that because it's coming. The money coming. It's here. Now, 444 is synonymous with the angels and the chosen ones. You chosen. We different, we different. We not like everybody else, okay? So once you realize that, you can um, be more receptive to receiving your blessings, okay? You, you're like hand-picked. You're hand-picked. Many are called, but few are chosen. Everybody not chose. Everybody not chosen, and you are. So you gotta act like one. You can't be around people that treat you like you regular because you're not. You not regular. So how are you gonna be around somebody that's treating you like you're regular? How are you gonna let somebody treat you like you chopped liver when you are a chosen one? Like you are fucking illuminated. You're an angel. You got divine guidance, protection all around you. Be mindful of that, for real. Act like you chosen. Stop acting like you regular and stop letting people treat you like you regular and you're not. Nothing about you is regular, okay? So 444 is letting you know that you are fully supported in your life's mission. Like your life's mission is always gonna involve helping somebody, some type of service, whether you're um, giving us laughter, you're providing us with beautiful melodies, whether you're creating something for us, whether you're serving us in some kind of way, you're helping us, you're teaching us, you're edifying us, you're making us laugh, like you're serving the people in some kind of way. So whatever you're doing is perfect for you and your angels are letting you know with this number that they support you in it. Like, my angels are supporting me with you. Like, this is my life mission. Spiritual teaching. Like, everything else I try to do, it don't really, it ain't really hitting on much. But, like, me talking about angels is so my life mission. Because I could talk about these all day. To those who understand. Like, I can't make you understand if you don't get it. But if you do get it and you are tapped in, I'm perfect for you. I can't go to somebody on the street and be like, look, have you ever seen 444? No, but if you tap into the 444 energy, I can most definitely um, help you with that. You get what I'm saying? That's my mission. You need to figure out what your mission is, like what you're here for. And you literally could just be here to entertain us, to make us smile, to make us happy, um, to teach us. 
to cook for us. Y'all know I'm always talking about food. I'm thinking about food right now. But um, whatever your life's purpose is and your life's mission is, your angels are letting you know, go forward with that. It may not make sense to anybody else, but if it makes sense to you and it feels good for you, this is like a little push and a little go ahead. You're here to serve. Like you're here to serve us. Humbly, like a humble servant. Like I will give you my time and my energy and I will create this for you. So what you here for? Tell us in the comments. What are y'all here for? When you see angel number 444, your angels want you to trust your journey because it's perfect for you. Just like what I just said, whatever you doing is perfect for you. Trust your journey. It's unfolding perfectly. They got you. They're supporting you. They're going to help you. And it's no right or wrong way to live your life. Like, it's no right or wrong way. Whatever you're going through is a result of your life experiences, your resources, what you've been through, um, how you hurt, how you heal, how you love. Like, all of that is perfect for you. So whatever your shortcomings are, it's the lesson that you need to learn. Nobody else can do it for you, okay? So just keep that in mind when you see this number. There's no right or wrong way to live your life. It's perfect for you. Whatever lessons you need to learn, you're going to learn them. And nobody can do it for you. So it's okay. Like, it's okay. You're good. They aware of you. They know what you need. They know what you lacking. They know what your strong points are. They know what you're here for. So you need to tap into that. 444 also represents your ascension to the fourth dimension. Like you're moving on up. Like right now we in the third dimension. You want to know about people money, what they doing, what they accolades are, what their accomplishments are, what they got in the bank, what they driving. Like that's 3D shit. Okay, it's the physical level. Like, what are your physical possessions? What are your titles? Um, however, when you move on up to the fourth dimension, it's more of a mental, it's more of a spiritual, it's more of, um, <laughs> it's like a little higher. <laughs> okay, it's a little more than the physical. It's more when you tap into the spiritual and you realize and you recognize it's something bigger operating on your behalf. Like those titles and them labels and them cars and all that shit don't mean nothing in the fourth dimension. Like you'll get it, but that doesn't define you. Okay, so you're moving on up from the 3D to the 4D if your angels keep sending you this number. And your dreams are soon going to come true. Like they're helping you accomplish your dreams and your goals and your wishes. All the things that you want to manifest in this 3D reality, it's nothing. It's nothing. It's too easy. Everything that you need is going to come to you in divine timing. You don't have to rush it. You don't have to chase it. You don't have to beg. You don't have to lie, cheat, steal for it. It's going to come right when you're ready for it. Okay? Just like in nature. Um, nobody has to tell the flowers when to bloom. Nobody has to tell the fruit when to fall from the tree. When it's ready, it's going to fall from the tree. When it's time, no man can stop it. Nothing, not a hex, not a curse, not an evil eye, not a bad intention. Nothing can stop what's for you. Period. Like, it's going to happen. It's going to unfold in the most perfect way and in the most perfect time. In divine timing. It's going to pop for you. That baby going to pop. <laughs> it's inevitable. It's inevitable. When you see this number, nothing comes to you by accident. It's no coincidence. It's happening because it's supposed to happen. Whether you perceive it to be good or bad, nothing comes to you by accident. You're on the cusp of many opportunities. There are going to be many opportunities available for you. Um, your angels are letting you know they're lining it up for you. And a lot of these are going to be lucrative for you. They're going to be money-making opportunities for you. So 444 also represents stable foundations, like four corners, um, four legs on a table, um, 
four elements is four chambers of your heart, four quarters in a game, four quarters in a dollar. So 444 is all about building firm, stable foundations. Like you gotta have a solid foundation. If you don't have a solid foundation, that structure is gonna crack, it's gonna fall. I don't care how much time you spent on it. If the foundation is not set, it is bound to fall. It's gonna crumble. So spend your time making sure that um, whatever it is you building, whether it's relationships, whether it's businesses, whether it's um, a home for real, for real, no matter what it is you're spending your time building or creating, make sure the foundation is um, firm and stable. It's not going to break. It's not going to crack. It's not going to fall because you're going to go higher and higher and higher. So you want to make sure you're fully supported and you've put the work in like you put the work in. There's no substitute for hard work when you see this number. It's no elevator. It's no elevator to success. You got to put the work in and nobody can do it for you. Now you have angelic support and guidance helping you and they may send some angels to help you on your path. But ultimately, this is you. The wins, the losses, all that is you. Okay, so focus on having a firm foundation. It's time to square your corners, square them off, put in the work, do what you need to do. Take action, like stop talking about it, stop manifesting, stop using law of attraction, <laughs> stop trying to attract it, put the work in, put the work in, do what you need to do, okay? And trust the process, build a brick a day, like trust the process, trust that you're doing what you're supposed to do, and it's going to work out for you. Your angels send you this number if you're going through a rough patch to remind you to stay grateful. Even when times are rough, stay grateful. It could be worse. It could be better. It could be worse. Just always focus on gratitude and being loving. Like I said before, calm is a superpower. Okay? Nothing comes to you by accident. You're going through it. It's perfect for you. The trials and tribulations that you go through and the blessings that you receive are the same exact thing. Once you learn that lesson, it's going to be a blessing at the end of that. Okay, so don't spend a lot of time like feeling sorry for yourself or trying to blame somebody. Learn what you need to learn so you can get to the blessing a little quicker. The more blessings that you give, the more will be returned to you because whatever energy you give out is coming back to you tenfold, hundredfold. I say that all the time. That's why I try to stay on the love vibration because I always get so much love. And it may not be from the person I'm trying to give love to. It comes from all over. Okay, so give more blessings and more will be returned to you. Heavenly rewards, divine blessings, the holy flow, the floodgates of abundance and prosperity and love and joy and clarity good feelings okay but start the love process start the energy by giving blessings how can you help somebody how can you bless somebody what can you do to help us just start the cycle so it can come back to you because everything you do out of love comes back to you 444 is closely connected to the angels and they want you to know that they are your biggest supporters. Don't worry about who's not clapping for you right now. This number is like a round of applause from your angels. Okay, like, hey, we here, we with you. We see the work you putting in. We proud of you. Keep going. Keep going. Keep doing it. Do more. What's next? Keep going. Okay, it's just a little go ahead sign. It's a pat on the back. It's a clap. Keep going. Okay, they're your biggest supporters. You don't need a fan club. You don't need man to support you. You don't need man's approval, man. 444 is letting you know, we got you. We approve of you. We going to help you. We just need you to keep putting the work in. In regards to love, this number, you get this number because your twin flame may be really close to you. And they're thinking about you heavily, excessively, obsessively. <laughs> Okay, your twin is near. Yeah. <laughs> so my last note that I wrote about 444 today was about the Bible verse. For John 444 was talking about a prophet not being welcome in his own town. And it was like how... um 
It was talking about how Jesus didn't stop in Nazareth. He didn't stop in Nazareth when he was going to preach the gospel because he said a prophet is not welcome in his hometown. Okay. And that is so true. That resonates with me so much because, yeah, it just does. I get so much love from all around the world. Like, literally. Yesterday, I sent another book to Canada. Like, y'all are from everywhere. Okay? But in my little town, ain't nobody checking for me. <laughs> and it's okay. <laughs> this number and this message was confirmation. It's okay because the world is so much bigger than your hometown. Don't focus on who's not supporting you or who doesn't believe in you or who is not recognizing you or who's not clapping for you. You got a whole world to tend to. You got a bigger fish to fry. You have so many more people to reach and to touch and to help and to um, heal that you can't worry about that. Like they'll catch on when they catch on. Okay. So remember that. Don't try to like persuade anybody or make nobody fool with you or support you. Just keep showing up, shining your light, using your voice, using your gifts, sharing your gifts, creating for us. And um, we're going to find you. The world is going to find you. We're going to discover you. We're going to support you. Just like how y'all supporting me. I'm sending books out every single day. And a vast majority of you are paying more to ship my books than my book actually costs, okay? Like, I ship so many of these books out. I don't really sell a lot in my store here unless they don't know me. And they're like, oh, wow, you wrote this book? Let me buy it. But for the most part, I'm shipping these books everywhere, like literally everywhere, okay? So don't stay focused on your hometown. Maybe it's bigger than your hometown, we need to hear you, okay? It's bigger than you. It's bigger than you. So, angels, I hope I gave you a divine message. I hope I gave you some good energy, um, a refresher for when you see angel number 444. I want to let you know that I'm so grateful for you. I'm so, um, I'm just full of love right now. My energy is high. I am um, in a very good space, a loving space. And I want to encourage you to do the same. I want to encourage you to show up. I want to encourage you to love on somebody, help somebody, send somebody some blessings so those blessings can come back to you. And um, put some hearts in my comments. <laughs> Y'all know I love the hearts. Y'all know I love the hearts. Let me know what your experience with angel number 444 is. If you still see in 444, let me know if you're a chosen one. Where y'all at? <laughs> Where we at? <laughs> On here. Okay. Um, I got a flight to catch tonight. So I need to kind of um, wrap this up a little bit so I can peace out. Thank you for being here. You could have been anywhere in the world, but you're here with me. Make sure if you do not have your copy of my book, Angels Everywhere, make sure you click the links in the description and you order your copies. Um, thank you for, yeah, thank you for just being you. And I love you and I'll see you in the next video.